this year that you did last year? Just have fun in the game. You know, you're going to have your good and your bad in each game. And um, last year, maybe we let the bad get the best of us. And um, this year, we're a more experienced group. And, uh, you know, we battled all year in every game. So um, just to keep playing like that and keep having fun like we've been doing. So, What things did you take from last year's preparation that you used or not used in this year's bowl preparation? Uh, I think just with us having more guys know more things has allowed us to, to, to practice better. And um, just being able to have more bodies and, and more minds developing has been huge for people recovering and, and people getting better and learning the system better. What do you think of playing in California? You know, I'm, I'm ready to get out of this cold weather. It was eight <laughs> degrees when I woke up this morning. My <laughs> doors are frozen shut. How do you guys kind of balance all the fun stuff that goes on during a bowl with being there to play a game? I mean, it's a business trip, but you're there to, to, to experience something you've never experienced. So, um, you know, I'm sure they're going to have a lot of great things for us to do. And, um, it's going to be great seeing a lot of different things that people wouldn't see in their lives without this bowl trip. And, um, you know, when we start practice, we're there for a reason. And when it's game day, we're there for a reason. And if you coach Ellen, can I talk about competitiveness? How important is it to have competitive parts of practice when you have a game to look forward to for I a mean, couple weeks still? I mean, it's huge. Uh, you know, those competitive plays don't just come, you know. you got to be a competitor and, and have the competitive nature to, to go out and not want to be beat. And, um, anytime you step on the field, you should always have that. So um, to be able to, to continue to do it in practice, um, it'll carry over into the game. You know, this is more of, a, of an issue thing, but uh, there's some concern that, that you guys are playing too many games, um, including the bowl game, which would be 13. Is that too many, or if the season's going on anyway, why not play a game as opposed to practice? I mean, I, I love playing in the game, so um, whatever they do, I'm, I'm just going to keep having fun playing in the game. So. Are there any younger guys you've seen really take advantage of the extra practices? Uh, yeah, we got a, a corner, Hendo, Thomas Henderson, and he's been doing really good, really stepping it up, and, you know, uh, he's always been good, and this week, like, he's really been able to, to show, like, he, he's, a, he's a guy you can count on, and um, it's going to be exciting in the future when the trust is built that he's going to be a guy playing, I hope. Were there any uh, young guys last year who really benefited from the full practice who kind of played a, a big role this year? I think a lot of the D-line, you know, they all got to got to keep developing and, and, and working on their game because uh, we came into the season with a whole new group, right? Um, you know, a lot of a lot of the wide receivers, like um, Nick and all them, you know, they came out into this season was they were way more competitive, making more competitive plays. Um, just things like that, like that you don't get as soon as the season ends, after you, once you experience a season and you see what it's like, and then those practices are done to keep developing, like that's tough. But last year, like they got to see it, and then they got to develop it and practice it on a higher level, and then it carried over into the spring and the, the workouts, and um, you know they played good this year. With the uh, you know with such a sudden change with. Uh, with the head coach position. How, how much responsibility have you taken on just kind of pulling that defense together? As far as the defense, um, you know, Coach Allen was our defensive coordinator the whole year, so um, we got faith in him. It's, it's more about keeping the whole team together, the offense too, the special teams. Like, it's all about us staying together. And, um, you know, I think the relationship we have with one another, bef even before, like, you, you're bringing the offense or defense, like, outside of here, like, I think that allows everybody to, to have a calm mindset and, um, you know, just being in the close group helped the transition um, be a little smoother.